Today's job market is tighter than ever. Young college graduates are having a hard time even starting their career. But are they quitting or running away from the problem? No. They're creating businesses that we didn't even know we needed. Meet Thad Faulkner, the world's first, get this, Fitbit walker. Uh, you know, I like to help people. And uh, somebody has a Fitbit, you know, they need steps. Ma'am, did you meet your step goal? Got to get your steps in. I graduated out of college with $100,000 worth of debt. I mean, crushing debt. And took a job as a dog walker. My friend gives me his Fitbit because he's trying to win his office pool. He says, hey, here's 20 bucks. You know, wear this all week. And, you know, he blows it away, wins all the money. So I'm thinking, $20 a week, if I get, you know, 10, 20 more people, that's like 2,500 bucks. I mean, that's a lot of money. I love our walks, but I hate walking. Thanks, Thad. My wife tracks me, so she gets really frustrated if I don't get my 10,000 steps. But I mean, thanks to Thad, I, I can play more video games. My life's fuller. My characters are way more advanced. I mean, it's, just, it's, it's a pretty great life. What happened to your eye? It's a go-karting accident. Some people uh, walk slow. Some people walk fast. Some people don't like to walk at all. That's where I come in. I'll wear your Fitbit, 20 bucks a week, no problem. But it hasn't all been peaches and cream. You know, 10,000 is the minimum. There's been some negative reviews as well. Hey, you guys are altering my voice, right? Like, can you do it in a lower pitch? Because I don't want to sound like a jackass. So my boss and I were synced up on Fitbit so we can see each other's steps. And uh, Thad was getting me so many steps on my Fitbit that my boss saw that. And he invited me to run a half marathon with him that Saturday. And so I went and did it. But I did so poorly that the following Monday, he fired me. He fired you for that? Well, I mean, it, it was either that or uh, the week before I tested positive for heroin. Um, I think about my parents and uh, my family emigrating from Nova Scotia um, and the hardships they went through. I just wish that they could see this. So, they passed away? No, they don't have a TV. Well, those are the pros and cons. I think I'll wear my own Fitbit from now on. This is reporter Troy Grant, reporting for Four Day Reports.